Let's measure the current too. Let's make it a good contact. This gap is quite wide. Let me measure it first. Well, you know, metal is generally conducting ten amps through a regular pencil's graphite. Wow, this is getting. Oh my god! Whoa! Oh! Okay, it's definitely shorter. Let's plug it in. Hopefully, nothing will happen and I'll know. Jeez. Wow. I'd better clean it up before they see it. Well, I basically ran away. The breaker for all the room outlets just popped. And it should turn or vibrate. Too much voltage. Let me reduce it by my auto transformer. To tap into our oven somehow if I pull it back a little bit. Thanks to the stupid design of the outlet, I can pull it back a little bit and expose the high voltage lines. Let's see what voltage we have. Stepped on stupid spaghetti down here. I have to clean it up. Okay, let's do it. There will show us if the phases are 120 degrees out or 180 degrees out. Let's check. Oh. This is super sketchy, but let's see if it works. Okay, and we'll bond over playing these games. So here's the jack-in-the-box contraption. You just turn it on, and anyone touches the handle will be shocked. In some of the outlets, especially in the kitchen, they bring two phases to the outlet. And to do so, if you look here carefully, they have to cut that tiny bridge. Always wear safety gloves to protect your fingers and don't try this at home. Let me see if I can make some arcs. <laughs> Always wear safety goggles when dealing with very bright arcs. Let's try it again. Nice, look at that. Nice. Am I on fire? Okay, ready? hands of the MOSFET by touching the positive and negative lines through my body. And now the relay can turn on a light too. <laughs> a stick and a uh -uh battery. Let's see how badly it shocks. It's getting shocked. Ouch! This is pretty painful too. Let's try it one more time. Ouch! Ow, I hate it! Let's try it one more time. It's really experienced one. What is now? It burn freezes. There you go, hundred amps, <laughs> and it's holding on. British oh <sighs> My auto transformer can't take that much power and feed some material through. You see, the LEDs start to get red as the head heat. <laughs> Let me demonstrate. I plug it in and now the rails are live, so under no circumstances you should touch the rails. Now I put the projector on. Look at that, people. Molten. Gosh. This glove is not good for this purpose. Remember that the white wire is neutral and that's where you would be connecting your program. The white wire was neutral. I connected it backwards. I'm measuring the capacitor voltage and it's around... It's not gonna heat up because it's plastic. Now if I turn it on, it draws power from the supply to heat up the...
installing something, don't put it in the microwave. More chance to get high enough voltage. And here is my handicraft. Let's measure and see where we are. It's higher.